Hello everyone. So today welcome to our live show, VGLC Technology, and today I'm going to reintroduce you a production line. Our production line for wood cutlery products. I mean the wood cutlery, including that wood knife, spoon, forks, and also we have the coffee sticker and also ice cream sticker. Yes, correct. And the first, uh, so follow my camera, and I will introduce you guys the whole process of this food production line. So we start from with the first machine. The first machine is that the wood cutting machine, and uh, you see that uh, you can put the rural material wood log here, and the worker will put the chili to the cutting machine. Then with the roller. The wood log will fall in and solve. So here you see that we have a fix here. You can fix the wood log here. And also the clamp will go down to fix the log automatically. And then the saw will go out to cut off the log. So this is a vertical cutting. And also it is automatically because with this automatically cutting machine, you can cut the wood log accurately, with high accuracy and also automatically. So no need labor, no need worker to cut it with by hand. So it is a high efficiency. Also, you can save the labor cost. Okay, see that we have a big motor here with a strong power. And here you will see our cabinet, electrical cabinet. So here I will show you guys that all our electrical parts are used the famous brand in the world. And here you will see our full blade here. Okay, this is the first step, I mean the first process, and follow my camera, we move to the second steps. Okay, the second is the steaming oven. So as you guys see on the camera, we have two big steaming oven here in our factory. This is two steaming ovens is prepared for our talent customers. This big oven is equipped with PLC control. I mean the temperature control system. Okay, I will show you guys the temperature control systems. So here with the power on, that you can settle the temperature here. And then you can also Okay, here. You see here, this is the steaming oven. This is the temperature setting here. You can set the temperature here in first, and then it will do the steaming automatically because different time, we need different temperatures. So after you setting the parameter here, it will do the steaming automatically. So no need people, no need worker to watch, stand here to watch it. Uh, to operate, no need. And uh, in generally speaking, it will take like uh, 33 to 40 hours in total. I mean the total process of this steaming. So as you guys see that we have uh, two big steaming oven here. And, uh, this two, uh, the size of the steaming oven, it can be customized according to customer requirements also according to the production capacity. As you see here, that, uh, we have uh, three trolley here. So you, after the cutting the wood log, we put the wood log here into those three trolleys. And then we will pull the trolley into the steaming oven. Okay, I will show you guys the inside of the oven. 
Okay, let's open the door of the oven. So as you guys see here, this is a big steaming oven that we loaded the food block here inside the chili and put the chili inside the oven. Then it will, after you setting the temperature, then it will do the steaming automatically. And uh, what's more, besides the steaming oven, we could also provide the boil tank. I mean, the boiling tank also can boil the wood. But so one problem is that the boiling tank they will produce some pollution water. So it is bad for the environment. So this is the only difference. But uh, it depends on customer need or customer requirement. Okay, this is the second process, and then. We go on. The after steaming, after boiling, we go to the barking machine. So you see, we have a barking machine here. It is always a strong big motor there and you after steaming you can put the wood log here for barking so the barking sickness can be settled down also in advance so you can make what kind of sickness you want so this process is better for next step i mean the next step is the rotary cutting steps so after burning the wood log, it will be better and more convenient for rotary. And uh, next, I will introduce you about the rotary cutting machine. It is. Because that we do not have a ready machine here in our factory. So I will show you guys in the computer. So you see this video that we have a rotor cutting machine here. It is a very high speed and high efficiency. You see for one wood log, you can see that it takes will like five or six seconds just uh, finishing the purling. Okay, this is another wood log loading. Okay, we can see one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, it's so like 10 seconds finished. So it's okay, very high after speed. the rotary cutting, high speed the speed machine. machine. We will into more okay. pieces. So we go to the next step. The next step will be the punching machine. I mean the shape punching machine. So we have two ready cutting machines here. This is also for our talent customer. Here after the cutting, the wood roll will hang out here. We have a three roller here. You can hang it up. This function machine also is a PRC controlled here. We can see here, this is the, the cabinet. Okay, right now you can see here is the PRC control here. We have a start stop. Also, you can set in the quantity. You can set in the feed less. I mean, how much feed less you want. We have a surf motor here. And also here, you can load the different modes. I mean, the different modes, you can load the mode for four. So then it will punch by this ship, the fork ship, okay? You can load the mode here for knife. Then the punch, after punching, it will become the knife shape and also spoon, the same. Also with different sides of the mode, you can also you can also get a different product size. Like you can get 160, you can get 130, 
as you want. And after the punching here, then it will go to the conveyor. So as you can see our conveyor here, oh, it is a food grid, okay? So it is a health for, for in fact, health, so no problem. And uh, after punching, then it will go up there with the conveyor all automatically to the drying bio machine. Okay, we go to see the bio drying machine here. It is also very big size. So I mean, here after punching, the conveyor will loading the products to the app. Okay, it will loading to the app to the bio drying machine. Okay, I will show you guys the inside. Here we have three layers, okay? One, two, three. The total length of this is 30 meters, okay? Because one layer is like 10 meters, so the total length is 30 meters. And here, we also have a smart control system here. You see here the smart drain systems. You can settle down the parameter here according to different products because different products may need different temperature, different humidity here. And then after setting the parameter here, you start running. Then it will do the drying automatically. Okay, you see the big fan here. We have a big fan here. After drying the moisture and the water will get off the products, then it will get off from this fan. We have a two big fan there, and we have another two big fan at the operation side. You see here, this is another two fans here. So this four big fan can make sure that the drying performance it means that uh, the drying performance will be perfect. So no problem for production. And here, follow my camera here. Okay, you see here, after the drying here, the products will get off, get out from the the oven and then it will go to the conveyor here so you see that we have many conveyor here which means the production line is high level automatically so no need too much works only one or two persons you can operate it okay and then products will go out and products also will use this conveyor to load the products into the polishing machine okay you see here we have a big polishing machine here. And this polishing machine is also automatically do the polishing. It is because before the hot press, the product need polishing to get the bread, to get uh, make uh, the product smooth so it can be good for the promotion. Uh, price. You see here, we have also control cabinet here for the polishing. Oh, you see here, we have uh, control here. I think it's a frequency control, which means that you can control the speed of the polishing. So we have one uh, reducing motor here. And the length of this also 10 meters. So right now you see in the video that we have uh, two polishing machine here. It is because that uh, more polishing machine will make the products more smooth. So it will be more convenient, more good for next step hot pricing. Okay, see here. 
This is the inside of the polishing machine, okay? And also you can see the thickness, the thickness of our polishing machine. It's a six point millimeter carbon steel. So it is a very strong structure. So this is also the difference between our factory to other suppliers. So all our materials, we use very strong steel here. It's six millimeter. So make the polishing machine. It's very strong and very tough. Okay. Okay. After the polishing, we will go to the smooth line machine. Okay, you guys follow my camera here. I'm here. After the polishing, the products will will run from here. Then with the bell, with the conveyor, the products will get up into the conveyor with the motor. Then it will go down. Here, we call it a smooth machine because it will make the products all products into one direction. As also you can see here, the material of our smooth line machine, stainless steel 304. It is a food grade. So no problem for health. And also the belt, the belt is also food grade. So we care much more about the health. And after the smooth line, we will go to the hot press machine. So for hot press machine, we also have air cylinder here to support air source for the hot press machine. <clears throat> and this hot press machine is also full automatically. So you see here, we have a PLC control here. You can settle down all the parameters here. You see here, like the fog, we already settle down the parameter here for the fog. I mean, the, how much length, how much thickness. You can also choose what you want. Here, you can also see that we have different buttons here. So it is also full automatically. Here. And also here, you follow my... So I want to introduce our output machine then from other suppliers. The suppliers only have two cylinders, but we have four cylinders. We have more to apply to our machine. Ah, 
啊啊啊！好，这个可以吗？有有有有有有有有 OK， you see here. Except for the cylinder, we also have the visual inspection here. I mean, the visual inspection is here that it inspects the, the bad quality products automatically. Here, after the hot press, getting done here, we have the visual inspection. The ins visual inspection will inspect the bad products. If bad products, then it will get off. It will get off. So. No need person, no need worker to do the inspection by eyes. So the machine can do the inspection by itself. Okay, and after after the visual inspection, we also can adding the counting function here. So the machine will counting the numbers by itself. For example. You setting that uh, okay, twenty pieces, folks, in one package. Then after the hot price, then after here, it will do the counting by itself. So it will counting to twenties, okay, twenty numbers. Then it will make a small stop. Then you can get of this twenty pieces, and you can also send down like twenty pieces, fifty pieces. Then you can do the packing. It is very easy. After packing, you can do the loading. Then Okay. Huh? You mute it Okay, sorry, just uh, because of the internet, we have uh, suddenly stopped. Okay, right now, let's continue. Continue with our final steps. Here, this is our packing machine. All the products will be here and following the conveyor to the packing. See here, we do the packing right now here with the PP plastic. So here is the roller here, the material. This is also food grade. So here we can do the piking with the machine that, and this brush, you see this brush? This brush will get the air out from the bag. You see here is the hot seal. And uh, after here, then you will see that a uh, full piking here. And after the piking, uh, it will go to the market for directly sales. So we provided the whole production line, as you can see that. Okay, as you can see that uh, this is our factory view here. So with GLC technology, we provided a whole production line for wood cutlery production which means that uh, we have a strong technology team, we have a strong service team, also we provide for our services, and if you guys are interested in our production line, you can let us know, okay? You can contact with us.